Hey, Louis, can I talk to you about something? Of course. Uh, what's up? Well, I've been working really hard on this weight loss journey, and I've lost a lot of weight, but I still have all this loose skin, and it's really bothering me. I hear you, man. Loose skin can be a real pain, but I'm here to help you out. Really? How? Well, for starters, you need to focus on building more muscle. That'll help tighten up your skin. And I can give you some tips on diet and exercise that can help you get there. Trust me, it takes time and dedication, but it's totally worth it. Thanks, Louis. I really appreciate it. No problem, Mikey. We'll get you looking and feeling great in no time. So in this video, we're going to talk about how to get rid of loose skin after weight loss. So you ready? We out. What's going on? It's your boy, Louis Hoffa Show. You know how we do. Today, we're diving into a topic that's been a concern for many people on their weight loss journey. How to get rid of loose skin after shredding those pounds. I've been receiving loads of questions from you guys, especially the fellas who's been crushing their diets for months and months, but still aren't satisfied with how they look due to all their excess skin. Hey, but don't trip because we're gonna explore the issue in depth and find solutions to help you feel more confident in your own skin. I'm ready, coach. First things first, let me clarify with what we're dealing with here. Many people make the mistake of excess skin with loose skin, but sometimes it's just stubborn fat hanging around. Before you diagnose yourself with loose skin, make sure that's what it actually is. You can easily tell by pinching the skin. If it's thicker than two or three milliliters, there's probably still some fat underneath. So let's focus on shredding that fat first. Huh? Oh, got it. Now, I know that there's stubborn fat in certain areas, like the lower abdomen or love handles can be a major pain, but we gotta be patient and committed to tackling it. And let me tell you, there's no magic diet or exercise plan that's gonna target that specific fat. It just takes time, consistency, and hard work. Did you say hard work? Ugh. But let's say you lost all the fat that you can and you're still left with loose skin. What can you do? Well, surgery such as abdominoplasty, I can't even pronounce that word, or a body lift is an option. But personally, I wouldn't go that route unless you exhausted all other options. Surgery is not something to take lightly. About 53,000 people undergo these procedures every year in the US alone. However, there are other less invasive solutions to explore first. Thank goodness, I'm scared of needles. One of the most effective ways to combat loose skin is to build muscle. That's right, time to get those gains. When you build muscle, your skin has to tighten up to accommodate it. Plus, let's be real, who doesn't want to look jacked? I'm sorry. Examples of exercises to focus on include compound movements such as the squat, the deadlift, and the bench press. Again, it takes time, dedication, and a well-rounded workout plan. But trust me guys, it's totally worth it in the end. And let's not forget about the importance of diet and lifestyle choices. Eating a balanced diet rich in protein, fruits, and veggies can help improve your skin's elasticity. Foods high in collagen like bone broth and those containing vitamins A, C, and E are essential for the skin's health. And getting enough sleep is crucial for both fat loss and muscle gain. Don't forget to take those omega-3s, which can be found in fish oil, flax seeds, chia seeds, and even try to consider taking creatine, which has been shown to help synthesize collagen. I got my grocery list. So there you guys have it, folks. A comprehensive guide of how to get rid of loose skin after weight loss. But let's keep the conversation going in the comments. Have you or someone else you know dealt with loose skin? What did you do about it? Did you try these methods? Share your stories and let's learn from each other. Online coaching will be available soon. I also have another YouTube channel if you're interested. We talk more about mindset, creating better habits, discipline, and achieving your goals outside of fitness. So if that sounds good to you, head on over to Lewis Hoffa Show. I'll leave a link in the description box below. And oh yeah, don't forget to bring the shreds and I will talk to you soon. Peace.